how you can be more motivated, more excited about your week, get more done, and therefore be happier. Why, my friends? Because satisfaction far outweighs the feeling of procrastination. Those of you that watch this channel will have seen it before. And those of you that haven't, hello, hello, greetings from beautiful UK. You might have guessed by the hood and the scarf, it's pretty chilly up in here. I'm sure not as cold as some of you are experiencing at the moment in America and in several other countries, but it's cold for here in the UK, so I'm wrapped up cozy. Got the dogs back with me, which is really, really beautiful. So out taking them for a walk. But first of all, getting this video on how to help you with more motivation, more productivity, and therefore better results. Somebody else out walking their beautiful dog. I love Sunday, Sunday strolling, isn't it just like beautiful? But of course, make sure that you do take the time to actually be in that nature as well and enjoy it, not just on technology or on your phone or on whatever it might be. Whoop! Cameraman nearly over the ball incident. Okay, so we were talking about how you can be more motivated for your week. Now, what is it that you want to achieve? What's your outcome? What's your goal? What's your vision? What's your mission? Everybody has different words for what it is that they want in life, for the life that they are creating. And I firmly believe that we all have that creativity, the capacity and the potential to create our life by design to be doing whatever it is that we want. And for some of us, that's traveling the world, that's speaking internationally, that's uh, big figures within your business. For others, it's having a sustainable lifestyle, living somewhere where, whoo, Bob's having a mad moment. Living somewhere where they're totally utilizing the land and they're self-sufficient. For some, it's a dream wedding, a dream holiday. For some, it's that charity and being able to help and give back in a certain area. We've all got different wants and missions. For some of us, it may be a combination of what I've just said. Who knows? But in order to really get excited and motivated about that goal, because when it is something quite big, often it feels a little bit overwhelming. So we keep putting it off. We put off taking action because it's such a, a big goal. We're not really sure where to get started. However, if you can break it down for the more logical minds, this is reverse engineering. For those of you that are perhaps a little bit more spiritual, this is more about breaking into chunkable steps that you can take aligned action in. So being able to progress towards you what, what you want whilst visualizing, whilst manifesting, you still have to take that aligned action. So it's looking at the goal as a bigger vision, getting excited about it, why you want it, and then breaking it down into smaller chunks. And then starting your week, each week, knowing what action steps, so what's your intent for the week? What action steps are you taking in order to be able to achieve what's important to you? Perhaps it's approaching more people within your business to get higher sales or higher figures. Perhaps it's about approaching certain connections to get more knowledge, more information, maybe even some form of collaboration. Maybe it's just reaching out to someone that you love and telling them that, telling them how much they mean to you and how much you enjoy being with them and spending that time having magical moments with them. Whatever it is, there's an area in your life that you are looking to improve. So what are you doing about making that change to improve it? Because one of my good friends, Liam, we laugh a lot because he says it a lot, a lot, a lot. I think it was Einstein that originally said it. But if this camera feels very close to my face right now. How are we doing? Yeah. Oh, we had the, the sunshine on my face. Anyway, back to that quote. If you keep doing the same thing, you will keep getting the same results. If you keep doing the same thing, you will keep getting the same results. So what are you changing? What are you doing? What are you mixing up in your week to allow you to get different results, take different action, get different results? What are you doing this week towards what is important to you? Remember, doing what is hard now will create a life that is easy. So let me know, comment below, what are you doing this week 
to help you towards your bigger vision, your bigger picture. For me, I'm going to be doing a lot of filming this week. We have a really exciting new project coming out. I am creator. If you want to know more, just put a little comment in below, but everybody will know very, very soon we are launching this month. So really, really super exciting. So I'm going to be doing some filming towards that project. Of course, doing these daily YouTube videos and a few other different uh, priorities that I have for this week ahead. One of which is having some beautiful time with my husband. He is up visiting this week. For those of you that don't know, just very, very quickly, that's why part of the reason why I'm able to be on this journey because I actually made quite a big sacrifice and moved away from my husband living in a completely different area to be able to fuel my connections, to be able to leverage the position of being here and therefore being able to travel, become uh, the international speaker. It all sounds sometimes still like a dream, but you know, this is exactly what I'm talking about, taking those action steps to achieve what's important important to you being able to see it to visualize it to know that it's possible and that you're doing it but actually to be able to take those concrete steps of inspired action towards it at the same time and that was something I did but anyway back to the video what are you setting for this week what's important to you what action steps are you doing share them below make it a public declaration because you're much more likely to take that action if you have shared it if you have told people about it so comment below and let's continue to rise together and of course if you have not already hit that subscribe button and the bell next to it for your daily notifications of inspiration education and motivation see you on the next one